Hi. Hello, it's us again. <laughs> Every time. <laughs> and Mr. Godfrey too. Um, today we're going to review and compare two uh, nail polish removers <laughs> that are cruelty free and toxin free. And we talk about cruelty free. Uh, Godfrey gets a little upset because um, he really doesn't like the way companies do test on animals. Uh, a toxic ingredient such as nail polish remover could be put into animals' eyes. And oh. injected under their skin. And they test it to see how um, it reacts. There are humane ways to test. We're not against testing, but just humane ways. And so all of our products will definitely be cruelty free. These two products that we're reviewing, and Godfrey wants to smell, um, nail polish removers. One is called. This is by Zoya. It's a um, five in five in one formula nail polish remover. This is my personal favorite. And this is Peacekeeper. Uh, Peacekeeper's logo is no nasty anything. Uh, they don't put any uh, toxic ingredients. And of course, you've heard of acetone. That's number one. You don't want a nail polish that has acetone. Um, so Pe Peacekeeper, uh, they they claim it doesn't have a nasty odor. I kind of disagree. I think it smells. <laughs> yeah, it's it's not as bad as like acetone nail polish remover, but. But it does have a little smell it to it. Smell. The difference between this and Zoya is this is this is a very good nail polish remover. However, if you're impatient, you may not want to wait that 30 seconds that you need to put it on your nail for it to. Yeah, you have to put it soak. on your nail with a cotton bud or a cotton uh, ball and just hold it on there for 30 seconds. And I don't know about you, I don't have the patience, but it does work. It does work. It's a good company. They have a lot of other great products that we'll review at another time. However, I prefer Zoya as well. Um, it's easy. Uh, the smell uh, is not also as strong. Of course, you shouldn't be putting up your nose like I did. <laughs> you don't want to inhale anything. That's uh, but this one not natural. <laughs> it, I mean, it, it smells. It, it's, it kind of smells good. You know, it doesn't have that really harsh, harsh chemical smell. Right. So keep in mind that a lot of these chemicals uh, that are in these products, uh, they contain. Uh, <laughs> Thylates, uh, toluene. Not these. No, a lot of products that you might buy contain those. Most nail polish uh, removers and, and cosmetics. Uh, yeah, and you don't want to buy those. So these are definitely free of all of them, uh, and that's what their claim is. We're very pleased, especially with Zoya. I Zoya, highly. and uh, we're gonna put the links to both these products if you want to try them um, in the description. I'll put the links and the prices. Um, there's, I mean, you can Google it and find them a lot of places online, but we'll put, I guess, where we got them from. Mm -hmm. Yes, definitely. Uh, and we will, did you say we're going to be reviewing the nail polish later? Uh, you just did. Oh, I did? <laughs> well, at a late, I don't know. Um, at a later time, we'll, anyway. We're going to be reviewing nail polish, uh, Zoya and Peacekeeper, right? Uh, yes, we do have both. I have Zoya on right now, but we'll talk about Zoya that another on. time. Um, anyway, thanks for listening, and I hope that you'll try some of these products. Uh, Especially this one. This is my favorite, and it works yeah. really, really well. Just as just as good as a regular nail, nail polish remover, if not better. Absolutely, it's really I quick. Hundred percent agree. Um, that's what we're using. Uh, we do have this, as you can see, that these products have been used, and you can see the Zoya is almost finished. So uh, that has been our favorite. Um, all right. So until next time, uh, thanks so much, and enjoy our products. And I hope you enjoy our video. Bye, guys. Bye.